Happy Easter, everybody, or happy remainder of Easter. I'm back with another video, and today is going to be a, a really interesting one because I am going to be covering Japanese Keshi figures. Now, from what I understand, Keshi figures are are uh, basically uh, rubber, little rubber figures um, that, are, that go on top of your pencil. You know, like those uh, toys you get and they have the little eraser holes that you put on top of your pencil and it, they act as an eraser. That's kind of what these are. These are Mario Keshi figures. Here's a Paragoomba. Here's a Boom Boom from Super Mario 3. I also have here Raccoon Mario from also from Super Mario 3. I got these three from uh I mean the three I just showed you I got from KingKeshi.com. They sell a whole lot of Keshi figures, and they're actually uh, quite interesting so far. I mean, I know I collect a lot of like anime statues and figures, but I wanted to go into the um, vintage stuff, or or so I read. Now this this bag of Keshi I got package of Keshi I got from eBay from some someone in Japan. I think it was like fifty or something. I don't know. I had to get my scissors. Let me just do this and I think we're in business. That's a lot. That's a lot. All right, so I got a Goomba. These are Hammer Brother, Hammer Brother, Frog Mario. Look at that. Look at this Frog Mario, Super Mario Three. When was the last time we saw that one? Here's a Ludwig von Koopa without the without its wand. I don't mind. I just like how these look. They look like little marshmallow candies. And I got, um, um, I think it's one of the cheap cheeps. Or it looks, it looks really, if it is, it looks really vintage. I think it is. And I feel the rubbery texture. I think it's one of those, uh, bloopers, vintage bloopers. And this one's a, a Buzzy Beetle, I think. Uh, I don't know. This looks like... I say this looks more like a, one of the Koopas. One little, one little Koopa Troopas. Uh, here's Mario with um, a mushroom. And here's another smaller figure of a... Uh, a lot of these are really vintage um, from Mario. I think I think I think from Super, the Super Mario Land games. I think there needs to be a Super Mario Land three. I don't know. 
but these are pretty cool. There's Lemmy Koopa or Hip Koopa from the cartoon. I don't care what anybody says, that cartoon was good. There's one of those like one of those like wrench moles that throw throw the wrenches at you. Wow. Here's a a, a sledge brother. One of like one of the one of the um bigger hammer brothers. Let's see, I think there's there's a whole bunch of others that oh vintage King Koopa, look at that. Another Goomba. There's there's plenty of cover here. I'm not gonna lie. Here's small Mario. Another blooper squid. And here's Iggy Koopa, it looks like. I think it's, it's another a paratrooper. A paratrooper. Paratroopa. One of the flying Koopas. Uh, and if I'm not mistaken, this one is Spike. Here's a Princess Peach. Uh, another, another hammer brother. I think a lot of these are gonna be re these are gonna be really repetitious. I um, I think or there's I don't know. Here's a a spiny. Wouldn't be surprised if I found a locky two in here. Is is basically uh from what I'm understanding these um most Keshi figures are basically um could be I think I'm could be same it could be a same figure. Uh, it, same figure but different color. So this is another Iggy Koopa. I like these so far. Uh, this might be a spiny as well. Can't tell. Here's another Paragoomba. And this one, another Paratroopa. Hmm. Peach again. Wow. There's a lot of these. There's Toad. Hey, it's Toad. <clears throat> There's another Raccoon Mario. <clears throat> huh. Hard to tell what this is because most of these are, I think most of these are, I'm just going off how I see them. I know most of these are from the Super Mario 1, 2, and 3, the, or no, not, um, Super Mario 2, Super Mario 1, Super Mario 1, Super Mario 2, Lost Levels, uh, Super Mario 3, uh, Super Mario, Super Mario Land, and Land 2, and that's, that's what I'm getting from these, but I like these little guys, yeah. Oh, well, what do you know? There's a, a Lockheed 2 in here. And he's on his little cloud. And some some frog thing, it's not wart. It's, it's uh, I don't know. I haven't, I need to look that one up. Look at this one, look at this. Look how tiny this thing is, look. See it? <laughs> Yeah, there's plenty here. I think, I think I spent uh, 100 something on these, like 115. I can't remember. But I kind of wanted these in my. I think I was due to have these in my collection anyway. So, I don't have any complaints. I just need somewhere to put them, like a, like an unused, uh, like like a used um jar or something, I don't know, hard, oh, uh, there's another piranha plant, these, uh, look like they're from the, I see, yep, these are definitely from the, uh, 80s and 90s, um, uh, Japanese Mario versions, I mean, that's, I mean, that's how I'm seeing it, but yeah, there's plenty of, uh, Keshi figures here, uh, I might not need to repeat myself on um, which ones I see. 
So, oh, wait a minute. I think this one is from the Super Mario Land games. Or I could be wrong. Hard to tell. But, yeah. These are all the little eraser figures I, or Keshi Gomu, I was able to buy. Yeah, in Japan they're called Keshi Gomu. But, I like these Keshi figures. I'm hoping I can find the ones from Zelda, Mega Man, uh, Transformers, and many others. So, that's my video. And if you're new to this channel... Uh, make sure you uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope to see you in the future. Take care, and I hope your Easter was good. Bye.